I'll keep it moving. I spoke about the man, and I don't know why. This was a naughty segue, to be honest. Canelo. Again, as careers go, yeah, I think he's got nothing less to nothing else to prove. Yes, there's a there's a there's a fight coming up. I don't think there's anything to prove. I think there's no, a fight. I, I disagree. I disagree. Why? What's he? Uh, I I don't think he's he could just see out his career. Like you mentioned that you think that Canelo could retire right now today. Yeah, absolutely. I disagree. I disagree. I don't think he could go out without seeing Bibble again. You know, not, not the type of man that Canelo is. No, because I, I went up to a weight that I should never and should never have been there. I was doing too much. Then when the guy is saying to you, the guy is saying to you, I'll come down to your weight then. Chill, man. You gotta know. see him. He's gotta see him. If Bimbo is saying, I don't mind if the weight is a thing, I'll come down to your weight. He's gonna take this journey as far as it needs to go. And if that is the state of play, you don't what he ain't walking away from that. Listen, Unless he truly believes he's going to lose. To the names. Listen to the names. I'm going to read you something real quickly so you understand why this guy can walk away. Again, 58 wins, 39 by KO, yeah? Two, what, we we'll say two losses. Let's go for it, though. Gennady Golovkin, absolutely beat him. Yeah? Dimitri Bivo, we don't talk about that one. <laughs> Dead. Yeah? Caleb Plant, and Caleb's on a tear right now. Doing yep. well. Beat him. Billy Joe Saunders, beat him. Beat him. Yield him. Beat him. Callum Smith, beat him. Kovalev, even younger Kovalev, beat him still. Well, not younger Kovalev. That's the Kovalev no, after Yards. Fought, and then yeah. that's after Yards Kovalev, but he saw something and he said, I can beat that guy. Yeah, which which gave him the false pretenses. He belonged in that division. No, you don't, bro. You don't. It was a mistake. Dan, um, Daniel Jacobs, beat him. Rocky Fielding, beat him. Gennady Go Golovkin, hold on, which one is this one? Because there's a Gennady. That's the one where people say he lost. Wait. No, no, there's two. There's three, remember? Gennady Golovkin in the second one, beat him. The first one, Mad Mad Ting should have lost. Mm. He now, nah, this was not fair. Chavez, G Liam Smith, Amir Khan, Cotto. Listen to the names, bro. Floyd nah, Mayweather, hey. a loss. So, again, as my career goes, if you're talking about names... Try and, try and name any names in the first 40. What? That's when he was fighting heavy in Mexico. Oh, no, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't I stopped, I stopped, I stopped. But I'm saying in terms of, yeah. in terms of like, as a career goes, a lot of people don't even get to have those. It's a very complete uh, career still. It's a nice, the CV. But said, I'm telling you, because he's not old, if he was old and he was up in his years to like 40s, and, you know, we have we wouldn't be having this conversation now because at this point you say, you know what, he's done it. But the fact is, he's his career started very young. Mm -hmm. So he's been pro since he was like 15 or something like that. Yeah. So realistically, yeah, you're still about, bro. So yeah, cool. Take the John Ryder touch. Yeah. That's a lot. That's a calm touch for you. John Ryder's yeah. going to come. He's going to be a game opponent, but he's going to lose. And then after that, see Bivol. If you want to wrap it off to Bivol, I'm out of that. Nah. But you've got to see Bivol again. Because if I'm it's at your weight, there's no reason for you to not see him. I'm cutting. I'm out of here. So Again, you're saying you're, you're so you're saying he should no because you're you saying just, he should you to lose, bro. You lot just having me out here to lose to the next guy. It's like keep fighting until you lose. You've him. already fought him and lost, so it's up to you. Do you want to avenge I, that? And then bravery to and I fought at a mad weight. I wasn't I wasn't really comfortable. Like, yeah, he can come down to my weight, but I don't want to ruin you from fighting Baturbia. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want to take all your focus. <laughs> hold on, hold on. What would Lennox do, bro? I know what Lennox would do. But Lennox, Lennox Ed was in there with Vitali, fam. New generational fighter. Yeah. No business fighting this guy. Would Lennox L ever... Late notice, opponent switch up thing. He said, all right, cool, run it. Would Lennox ever drop weight and become a light heavy just to see what he can do at that, at that, in that weight class? No, but he's not leaving something op open like that. He fought Tyson because he didn't want the barbershop conversation to look nuts in the years to come. Yeah. Will Lennox even go to cruiserweight? That's to see why I'm going at that level. He ain't doing it, bro. He's not. No, you're, you're making it about the weight, whereas I'm not making it about the weight because Bivo is willing to come down to his weight. Why are you shouting for? Because you need to understand that you're chatting worse. <laughs> no, you look just want to see my guy lose. This is the you and uh, you're scared because you know it's gonna happen. I, I listen, I, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Yeah, and it's very, very, now we're at the root cause of this conversation. But I can ruin things again. Legacy's legacy, bro. Right now, we're looking at the we're looking at what he's done in this game. You're saying, you know what? That's a good career. You've had a yeah, good career. He's had a great career, but don't you went up to light heavy, yeah? 
You knocked on that door. Bivol said, go back down there. Now Bivol saying, furthermore, I'm going to follow you home. And I'm taking what's there. Now you can't, you cannot, bro, you've awoken this team. You left that fight saying you want the rematch. You left that fight saying you're going to see men again. He's saying, don't stress yourself eating them protein shakes. I'm going to come to your house. Bro, it's looking, it's looking gang. You can't, re you retire now. It looks bad. No, no. He looks bad. He left Bivol out there. Bivol's willing to come to your weight and and no, fight for the belt. He could be chatting. He might not seriously be trying to come down to the weight. You bro. Bro, you got like heavy to work to do, bro. You might not want to come. And I don't think it's a wise move. Anyway, let's quickly talk I don't, about. I, yeah, it's I don't think it's move. wise. I mean, get, you're, you're talking about undisputed. I understand because Bivol's doing some legacy hunting as well. He's playing the legacy game and it's money game as well. Where you, you can get the best of both worlds. You get legacy, you get the money. And it's fine. But again, Baterbiev, yeah? Because you could ruin all of this. If you don't handle in... Again, you know when you could... You could move into someone else's house and do a mad thing. But if your house is still mashed up, problems. you got to go handle that light heavy smoke. And then you can come around and say, hey, let Wagwan over here. But your main thing, the bread and butter, the, this is where you belong... You can't mess this up. And people are going to have it. Again, the excuses are already there. I can see all the bivol, all the bivolites saying to me, oh, boom. Um, yeah, that's what I'm calling them, bro. All of them will say, ah, look at the fuck like this. And They'll be like, ah, he should never gone down in weight. If there weren't no weight thing there, 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 they would have beaten Batavyev. Nope, don't want to hear it, bro. It's mm. saying up excuses already. Where you run into? Because don't tell me I'm ducking. Go and fight him, bro. He's in your weight class. Now you wait. There you I go. Tell you what it is. I tell you what it is. It's Paterbiev, then Canelo. I like because I you're you're right. I don't think if he drops weight and the weight affects him, like Eubank Jr., that weight coming off, clearly the punch resistance ain't the same. It's mad. So if that happens and he ca he catches a Paterbiev shot. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's gonna Bro. Be a sad day. It's gonna be a hundred percent knockout, bro. Don't mess around with things that like, when we when we got undisputed, when undisputed is on the like it's on the cards again. You will still be legendary anyway. Yes, then after you complete the mission, like Canelo, go around and do a matting. Go around and play about. Yeah, mm. but before that day, nah. Come on, and he still got to see Josh Boatsy. Still got to see him. Oh, Boatsy might be the fight. Yeah, for real, for real. <laughs> So well, that's, see a, that's an interesting one. Again, that's another thing of him being jumped, dropped in the deep end. Yeah. I mean, you was he in the deep end heavily with the uh, Bivol this fight? Is this the way he's supposed to be? He's meant to have yeah. this fight. Yeah, I mean, we're here, we're here now. This is has, this he, has, he, has, he, has he has he has he has he had, he had, had the same. adequate preparation? The preparations, the preparation. End of the day, we're running out of time. If everyone else has jumped up and fought it, um, and had title fights, Craig's had a title fight. Um, what the hell is the issue, that? Craig's had a title fight. Who else has had, yeah. a, yeah. had a title fight? Two title fights, and you, you ain't had one. And you're supposed no. to be the main. You're supposed to be leader of the pack, big man. I'm saying, title fight. I'm, yeah, no, I'm not against it, but he ain't fought it since May, and he's now going up against Bivol. Let you right. handle you handle whatever's in that in the background, and I'll just watch called mute. So it's I can't. It's the work of my clean the guy outside. Oh, uh, you got bare money. So you saying you got workers just in the house like like that? No, nah, it's outside to clean the gutters on the side of the house. <sighs> oh man, I wish to be you, fam. You're such an idiot, bro. <laughs> man from the south, you got someone cleaning the gutters, bro. You've done it. You've achieved a lot in life, you know. Hold on, let me play. man. You deserve some accolades. Yeah, bro. You, you do, do deserve do some accolades. <laughs> You're an idiot, bro. Bro, you never would have seen it. You know you can say, hey, I just got these gutter guys coming around to clean the gutter line. They're just going to be here. Don't worry about the sound. No, man. <laughs> no, you've achieved I it. I deserve some accolades. <laughs> Yeah, bro, you do. <laughs> you do deserve an ah, please. You're an idiot, bro. Hey, you got, sorry, I got thrown off. We we're talking about Boatsy. I said Boatsy ain't fought since May last year, and you're just running into Bivol. Run him in so, there. So, so you're saying he, he shouldn't have a, a little run-up? He shouldn't have had a run-up by now? No, because, again, people are asking questions, and it's making it harder. For, I can't answer some of the questions that you lot are posing to me. They say, why do you have him so high? I say, because he's high, bro. He's done some big things. And then now it's like, he should have. The warm-up fights he's meant to have, 
he was um, inactive because of injury or whatever they say was going on. Again, they BT tried it, tried to have him on there. He's like, I'm not trying to be on BT. Now he's on BT though, crazy. Um, but then there was some cheating. There was some cheating allegations on the other guy. They want to get tested or something like that, right? Is that just remember there was oh, a one time um, that, was, that he wouldn't. Oh have... yeah, that's right. It was. Yeah, um, yeah. Ad- I think it was Adonis. The Canadian yeah. in Canada, yeah, 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 that's right. Like, nah. oh, so the, yes, the, the warm up fights, the gimme fights haven't been there, but bro, now it's time. It's time. People are getting tired, even your own um promoters wondering, like, raw walk one. I think throw him in there, but if he wins, Travis, I told you, I said it before, I'll say it again. If he wins, yeah, you see this podcast, the way I pull up, you're gonna, I'm gonna be a prick, I'm gonna be something else that you never see. I before. won't. I won't even be I like yo. It won't be smoke. I'd be rooting for Watsi in that fight. Yes, yeah, fine. Let's, let's be clear. Let's be clear. Right. Like, and I'll say, what you call it? I'll say, look at my dog. Now I know my dog. I say, bro, look at my dog, fam. I was right. You was wrong, fam. In your face, bro. Now go get my go get my escrow money, fam. That's what I say to you. Listen, and I say, listen. At the end of the day, the KG undefeated podcast. Um, what you call it? I'm supporting. Supported if Yard, <laughs> if Yard and Boatsy fought yeah. today, Yard is the favorite, bro. Don't talk. To, if I become champion, don't talk to me like that. Have some respect. Oh. Everything changes. Everything. Ch- the whole again. Even you know what Yard would have to come win something soon because I will talk to you with total disrespect. There will be no. I have to. I have the fight no- at that point to make is Yard and Boatsy, bro. Huh? Yard and Boatsy is the fight to make after that. No, 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 no. I could be saying what? So he said he got to go see Batabiev. If he sees Bivo and he wins it, big man, champion, bro. On my yeah, first fight. Yard is the one you got to see. Bro. Because that's the fight people want. Bro, you failed your driving test twice. Don't talk to me, fam. Uh, when I'm doing big, you're doing big. I'm, I passed my theory. I've done all that, bro. Have, has a perception. I moved through that, bro. Don't talk to me. So what are you saying? You're driving around with a Corsa for cheap insurance. <laughs> You tell me we can't fight. You tell me we can't fight because you got a Corsa oh, now. Get out of here. Get out of here. Corsa with the thing, the stereo that comes out as well. You know, you know, you, you know you, uh, remember that little piece. People don't even know what's getting free. You had the little case for it as well. You know. Yeah, yeah. And you thought nice. The front of the radio. Have it. You just walk around it. with this logo. <laughs> you this just remote like, control looking thing in your hand. Yeah, drive still. Mm, yes, outside. All right, cool. Um, that's funny. Yo, people, thanks for watching the Undefeated Podcast. Make sure you like, subscribe, share, leave a comment and all that good stuff, man. This is the place to be.